Most AI tools for Amazon sellers, frankly, don't work all that well, but that all changed a couple weeks ago. In this video, I'm gonna break down a mind-blowing tool for creating Amazon creatives for free within your Amazon ad console. I'm gonna show you how it works, why you need to be doing it today, and a step-by-step -step tutorial. So let's go. What is up guys and welcome to Heist, the YouTube channel where I deep dive into strategies that can help you scale your Amazon FBA business. So look, AI tools have been all the rage the last 18 months or so. You're probably sick of hearing about them. I'm a little bit sick of talking about them. But this video today is special. A couple weeks ago at Amazon's ad event Unboxed, they unleashed a powerful, mind-blowing tool for AI-powered image generation for your Amazon ads. So there's a lot of problem with creatives, right? We know that having a bunch of creatives, A-B testing stuff is gonna give you bigger results for your campaigns, better conversion rates, but it's really expensive if you're gonna do photo shoots all the time to do this. On the flip side, there's all these AI tools for images, but you feel like you need to be a computer programmer to use this stuff. You know, I've tinkered with Mid Journey and a bunch of the other ones, and while it's cool what they can do, it's really, really clunky, and it's certainly not scalable for generating a lot of images, uploading them into your Amazon brand ads, and scaling your campaigns. It's also really hard to set these ads up historically if you have multiple marketplaces you're selling in for Amazon, as well as if you've got a really large catalog. Enter Amazon's AI-powered image generation tool. This thing's literally a couple weeks old, and what's really powerful about it is you can actually create these images within your Amazon ad account. For your entire product line, you can generate dozens of custom AI-powered images, create different scenes, do things for seasonality, and really scale your ad creative and sponsored brand ads in a way that has just not been possible before. Before. You can also do custom text prompts to get the exact scene that you want. You can add themes for different seasons. And the really cool thing is you can save all of these images to your asset library. So it's super easy to implement these things in A-B test. But what really matters obviously is click through and conversion. There's been some analysis on this. And if you were to just take a standard product image versus a custom lifestyle image, like you can do with this AI tool, you can see a 50 plus percent impact in your click through rate. It means cheaper ads, cheaper sales and a more successful Amazon brand. So how do you do it? Well, this is how we do it. All right, so let's dive right into this. You can literally set this stuff up in around five minutes. Super easy to do. You're gonna to wanna to start in the Amazon Ads console. And what we're gonna be doing with these AI generated images is we're gonna be using sponsored brands campaigns. So that's the way that you can use these custom images. So you can name your campaigns whatever you'd normally name them. You can set your normal budgets, however you wanna set those budgets. Doesn't really impact things much here. Do what you normally do. But what we're gonna do here is we're gonna use a product collection, which basically uses custom custom images, and then showcases various products from your catalog underneath. You can send those to a store, to a new landing page, to a custom URL. In this case, we're just going to do a new landing page. Now, the next thing you're going to want to do is to actually search for your products. So if you have your own catalog here, you'll see them come up in the drop down. Otherwise, you can actually enter a list of ASINs. So I'm going to use an example here of just a Amazon Basics Dutch oven for simplicity. So I've got three of them selected there. You just hit add and then it's going to show all of the different products that you're going to use on the carousel there on the right. Now you can do keyword targeting or you can target other competitive ASINs. In this example, we'll just stick with keyword targeting. You can basically select any of the keywords here manually if you wanted to, or you could add all of them there on the right. Or if you wanted to enter your own list, you can enter those. Similar to other ad types, you can select broad phrase exact. All that stuff is the same as other campaigns. Now here's where it gets interesting. It's really in this creative section. So you would add your logo like you normally do, put in your brand name, any headlines you want to use or test. It's got the products there. But if you see here, there's custom images. And this is really where the magic happens. So basically, on the add image drop down, you're going to see something here where you would basically normally have to do a custom photo shoot or use some other tool, save them, bring them into Amazon, upload them. We can do all this using Amazon's AI generated image drop down right here. Now, once you click on this, we can just generate if we want to just see what Amazon comes up with naturally. It takes about 30 seconds seconds for the images to appear. And voila, just like that, it's got four different scenes. Some have produce in it. Some of it's in a modern kitchen. And it's just really amazing stuff. This looks like it's like a world-class photo shoot, right? Now, the other thing, if you don't like your listing image being used here, you can actually go ahead and upload a custom product image if you want. And that doesn't need to be your listing image. The main thing here is for this AI tool to work really well, it's got to be a white background. So if you want to use something different than your listing image or your listing image has some, maybe a 
box in it. You can upload a custom image here. So let's look at some other things. Uh, another really cool thing is the theme option here. So right now this has no theme, right? But I could come in here and just say, hey, I want to actually do a contemporary kitchen. And that's kind of the vibe I'm looking to get. I want a more modern kitchen. I hit generate. Once again, it's going to take about 30 seconds and produce some contemporary kitchen images. So now I've got four new images this time in a contemporary kitchen. Again, super slick stuff. This does not look AI generated. And for you to Photoshop this stuff using other software would be difficult for you to shoot this with a photographer is probably going to run you a thousand bucks plus. We've done all this for free literally in 30 seconds. So just another example of another theme. This is a farmhouse. So if I didn't want contemporary kitchen, you can see here just a totally new dynamic with a different kitchen scene. But here's where it gets really interesting. You can actually come to this image description and you can add your own prompts if you want very specific customized things in addition to these themes or in addition to the generated images, you can add those here. So what I could do here is say, for example, say add Christmas holiday decorations, hit generate. And boom, just like that, we've got Christmas ornaments, we've got kind of pine needles with decorations in the back. We've got these ones here. Really cool. And you can play with this stuff. So if I didn't like this, I could add some new descriptions or I could regenerate and it's going to give you additional options. But let's say we like this one, right? It's kind of got the Christmas vibe here. I've got a farmhouse kitchen. Again, amazing backdrop. You wouldn't know that this is not a photo shoot. It's that good. Now, this is also really interesting. I can actually save this to creative assets library. And what that enables you to do is I could test this on multiple different ads so I could build up a full library. But in this case, I could take all 28 images and I could test them across different campaigns using A-B testing. Or if I want to just add this unit into a single campaign, I can add image. I'm going to go ahead and add image here just to keep things simple. But you can now see here, once I've got my headline and I've got my logo, I've got this now amazing backdrop photo. If I wanted to add another image, I could again upload my own. I could actually choose from creative assets, which is where you can add them to the library. Or I can choose another AI generated image to create. But super simple, dynamic, literally the amount of cost savings since this is a free tool is incredible. The improvement in click-through rates that you can see, and frankly, just the simplicity. Being able to do this within your Amazon ad console in literally 30 seconds or less, set up multiple campaigns across multiple products, no graphic designers, no photographers. This is really a game changer. Then you just submit for review and your work here is done. So that's it guys, super simple. Implement this literally today in your business. Don't sit on this stuff. It's really powerful, especially as we head into Q4 and 2024. Ad creatives, leveraging scalable tools like this that can scale your business is a must do. If this is your first time here, click that like and subscribe button. If you're returning, really appreciate the support guys. Wish you the best of success with this tool with Amazon ads and your Amazon FBA brand. We'll see you next time. Cheers.